In this video, we're going to review the medieval shop's old Norse axe, that is this one right here. Finding good quality armor and weapons for reenactment can be really hard. There isn't a lot of bricks and mortar stores in Australia, and buying online can be hit and miss. G'day everyone, my name is Ben and welcome to Medieval Mayhem. On this channel you'll find lots of videos into the whole medieval period. You'll find reviews into other people's gear, you'll find crafting videos into making your own costumes, you'll find DIY videos into making your own furniture, you'll find how-to videos into all sorts of medieval camping and that kind of thing. We do videos for, we analyse historical events, what happened, who were the key players, and why did things turn out the way that they did. So if medieval is your thing, this is the channel for you, and you might want to consider subscribing. I really do like this axe. I'll say that from the get-go. Medieval Shop is also a, a really fantastic bunch of people. Uh, they've got a lot of very knowledgeable staff, and I really like the way that they have. Um, they interact very well with people at the medieval festivals and events and I really do recommend if you're looking for some good pieces of kit give these guys a try. I'll leave a link in the description below. Alrighty so I've been looking for some axes for my friends and family and members of my medieval reenactment group. Looking around and uh, really looking for some axes that we're not just fighting axes but also the utilitarian approaches and this is one of the axes that I, I purchased from them a couple of months ago. It's a really nice piece of kit for $61.40. Uh, I think it's a really good piece of kit. 51 centimeters on the, the haft of the handle and if we take a look at the axe you have a really nice profile there of the, the axe head itself and also the handle. The handle is a nice oval shape, I like that. The reason that I like that is it gives you a lot of feedback as a user as to where your axe is in relationship to your target and how it's going to strike the target. That's important because if I'm not striking in a perpendicular fashion then the, I can lose control of my axe and it becomes a bit dangerous in a fight training environment. This is a sharp axe and you'll need to dull it down if you want to use it for fight training and also round off the edges. It is 1.064 kilos which is quite a light axe. You see a lot of people throwing these axes and the, um, the way that this is, is kind of designed and has been turned out uh, it's, it's very suitable as a throwing axe. And the axe head itself is 16 by 5 centimeters. I find it's a very good piece of kit. I, I do recommend it. Uh, and for those of you who are into um, early medieval reenactment, then I think this is a really good piece of kit and definitely something you can consider. Right, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share. I'll catch you in my next video.